Hello guys, we're back again for another episode of Call of Duty Modern Warfare Remastered. And don't worry, we won't be restarting, uh... Um, it's not gonna like, I'm not gonna boot from the menu every single time, but, like, for the moment, I will, for this one I will, because I'm booting the game back up again, because I needed to do some editing and whatnot, um, for the first part, the second part, and also, I need to do the thumbnail as well, so... Hang on, are subtitles enabled? I'm not entirely sure. Should be. The vehicle is now stationary, okay. Today. Is that in a foreign language? I think it is. Yeah, that is in a foreign language. Oh, just let me check my options here. Um, graphics, show blood. Uh, subtitles. We will trust uh, this man to deliver our great nation to a new era of prosperity. Okay, yeah, these guys are speaking in a foreign language, I don't... You're gonna have to read the subtitles to this bit, guys, I'm sorry. I could have swore this bit was in English in the original. Uh, correct me if I'm wrong down in the comments. But I could have swore originally this was in English. Um. Yeah, I believe there's some kind of insurrection going on right now. Um. Ooh. This is a bit grim. <laughs> He's being arrested. Okay, I uh, I think I may have fixed the audio issue. I will see after this. If not, you won't hear this commentary, so it doesn't matter. But if you're hearing this commentary, you know it's um, it's fixed. I must admit, this looks stunning with the new uh, the new graphics. I wish there's a way you could switch and see or have them side by side or something. He's got a Mac 10 in the front, I think this guy. Uh, and also, depending on the length of the first episode, I may attach these two together, or I may do them separately. It depends whether I'm happy with the length or not. Uh, we'll see. But, um, yeah. Because I'm pretty sure this is still the game's opening, so... Yeah, this is uh, an insurrection going on. Uh, yeah, I'm. I <laughs> my guy ain't getting much say in this. 
Yeah, getting dragged. <laughs> it reminds me of the start of Heretic from Halo to this bit with the eyes opening and closing. It's pretty cool how this has been done actually. This, this is the um, intro credits. I kind of like how they've integrated it into the game's story though. It's cool. Mm. I must admit, Modern Warfare 1 and Modern Warfare 2 are probably my favourite story wise from all the Call of Duties. Oh boy! Yep, um, this is. This is how it begins. Oh, that's a deagle. Boom. Well, that dude's dead. <laughs> Jeez. The Modern Warfare series have a habit of kicking games off with really grim openings. Has anyone else Captain noticed Price, that? Al Assad just executed President Al Falani on national television. The Americans have plans for Al Assad, and it's too late to do anything for Al Falani. But in less than three hours, codename Nikolai will be executed. Nikolai, sir. Nikolai is our informant in the ultra nationalist camp. He supplied the intel on the cargo ship operation. Nikolai. Okay. Why does that sound Russian? We need to get the. Nikolai's in hell right now. We're gonna walk him out. We take care of our friends. Let's move. Yeah, let's show about the SAS, get it done. And that's one thing I love about this game as well. You play as the SAS, which the is like. They're expecting us half a click to the north. Which is like every flipping ten year old British boy's dream, flipping SAS British Special Forces. Like, you know <laughs> Let's be honest, how many of you guys had the flipping camo uh jeans and everything and like the flipping Oh shit, was I supposed to shoot that gun? Yes I was. Okay, there we go. <laughs> Crisis averted. Oh, oh yes, of course. COD 4, you have all the tactical gear. This is awesome. Claymores and flipping everything. This is what... Call of Duty lost something after COD 4, I think. COD 4 was the probably the greatest Call of Duty ever made. With maybe World at War surpassing it? I don't know. I... Jeez, Gaz, chill down, man. Jesus Christ, guys, chill. Chill out, guys. Leave some for the rest of us, would you? Yeah, again, like, all the multiplayer maps in this game have been taken from some point in the campaign. Hello lads. This is why claymores are great. Oh come on, come out. Yeah, that's what you're supposed to do. Oh. Nade. Okay. There we are. Must admit, you gotta be a lot more careful playing COD 4. It's not like as gun ho as the other CODs. You gotta be a lot more careful. Especially in missions like this and Gilly It Up. Gilly It Up is probably one of the greatest Call of Duty levels ever. Like, period. I don't care where you're from or if you prefer the Black Ops games. Gilly It Up is probably one of the best levels ever. Period. I mean, just look at this. Uh, you've got a really slow walk and you've got a medium yeah. walk. You smell that? And you've got a sprint. Yeah, camera off. Welcome to the new Russia, Captain Price. 
What's the target, Kamarov? We've got an informant to recover. The M21's on the other side of the hill. The rackets have killed hundreds of civilians in the valley below. Not so fast. Remember Beirut? You're with us. <laughs> I guess I owe you one. Bloody right you do. <laughs> I'm guessing that's something uh, Soap wasn't around for. Again. Ah, good spot for some sniper action, huh? Well, I have just the ticket. I have just the ticket to punch their ticket with. <laughs> Sniper team in position. Guys, cover the left flank. Roger, covering left flank. All units commence the attack. That is why. Take out the machine gunners in the window so camera off men can stop the building. Okay, where's that? So take out the machine gunners in the windows. Ten o'clock. Ten o'clock. What am I looking for? Jeez Louise. I forgot some. So hit those machine gunners. Ten ah, ten o'clock. Ah, I see him. There you are. I can't get that one, he's too far. Get the other machine gunner through the wall. Oh yeah, through the wall. Nice. Okay. Helicopters, camera. I didn't say there wouldn't be any either. We need to protect my men from those helicopter troops. This way. Make it quick, camera. I want that informant. You have nothing to worry about. We'll take out the M21s and carve a path straight to your informant, Captain Price. Oh, God. Price and that have all buggered off. Okay. I must admit, this mission looks a lot more impressive on the Xbox One. It, I remember playing this originally on PC and like my jaw dropped, but this is pretty impressive. Oh, Gaz, watch yourself, bud. Oh, I have a grenade launcher. Nice. Is that any use? Uh, I'm gonna knock the grenade launcher on the head for now. Oh, whoops. Sugar. Oh, God, move. That's not healthy. Okay. And you can't slide in this one. Okay, let's see. Oh, nuts. See what I was saying about you can't be so gun ho in this one? Kind of forgot that. I'm firing over the top of a sofa. This is like just ridiculous. How the hell am I even still alive right now? Surely the bullet should have gone through this thing. Apparently sofa is sufficient cover. That that is actually Sofa's a bulletproof, don't you know? My men have run into heavy resistance. Help me support them target down. Dragon off. I can't identify what's an enemy or not. Yeah, those are enemies. Okay. Clear these guys out. Okay, and we have a guy up there. And we have another guy up there. Okay. So he runs in exactly the same line as the guy who literally just got shot. Okay, that's that's smart for you. Okay, there we go. That's a headshot. Nice. Nice. Oh, those are our guys. Okay. So I need to take out this guy here, I man. He's got a bazooka. He can't do much good. What did he? He just took one to the noggin like a champ. Did you see that? That that is crazy. He just took a, 
a sniper round to the noggin like it was nothing. That is like... Now we are making progress. That is just crazy. He took that like a complete and utter champ, like no damage taken there whatsoever. And these guys are buggered off again. <laughs> Great. You know, props for communication squad. <laughs> props. Don't feel the need to tell me when we're moving out, Cap. Okay, so let me guess. Use these zip lines, right? Look, the final assault has already begun. With a little bit. Enough sniping. Where is the informant? Stutti Zelias. Stosumas Shell. Where is he? The hounds. The hounds of the northeast end of the village. Well, that wasn't so hard, was it? Now go and sit in the corner. So, guys, we've got to reach that house before anything happens to the informant. Let's go. Oh, sorry, Cap. You're up. Okay, nice. Hold X to repel. Let's go. Oorah. <laughs> no, wait. Oorah. That's the Yanks. That's not us. Okay. Let's go. Move. Let's move it, squad. I'm guessing we're rushing the house. He clearly didn't care much of his own life, did he? Oh, I don't know. That's a guy now. Oh, hi. Okay. Reload. Um. Check corners. Cap gas. Me boy, gas. Right. Shit, check your corners. <laughs> That's what you get for not checking your corners. <laughs> oh, okay, let's move. Keep moving. Bloody hell, let's move. He may still be alive. Oh, God. Move. That was uncomfortably close. Right. Okay, let's move. Power. So, get ready. so we're going in through the front then. Guys, do it. All right, I've got the power. Go. Night vision on. Let's go. Now this is what everybody thinks when they think SAS. Flipping Black Ops. <laughs> yep, that's exactly what people think when they think SAS. Dropped him. Clear. We're clear to move up the stairs, Cap. Oh, you want me to go first, right? Okay, I see how it is. New kid goes first, right? Ah, through the wall! That 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 is some pro shooting right there through the goddamn wall. Uh, M9, nah. I'm not gonna take an M9. Uh, right, let's have a look. Let's check the corners in here first. Uh, we still need night vision. Oh god, that guy just took me completely by surprise there. That was flipping. Should have done that really. Um. All right. We're all clear. Oh, wait, no, we're not. <laughs> Still can't see a damn thing. Okay. It's him. Nikolai, are you alright? Can you walk? Yes, I can still fight. Thank you for getting me out of here. Don't thank us yet. Big Bird, this is Bravo 6. We have the package. Meet us at LZ1. Over. Bravo 6, this is Big Bird. We're on our way. Now. Let's go. Disable night vision. Let's move. I must admit that was actually pretty awesome that that sequence there is probably one of my favorite ones in the entire game just like going through the house on night vision like with the uh, laser sights on it's just like honestly it's awesome 
It's one thing I love about Call of Duty when they get moments like that just so right. Like moments like this where you're waiting for them to get to extraction. But boom. Captain. Give the salute. Oh, okay. This is interesting. Tell us more. Okay. Dancing in the dark. Kill the power. U.S. Marine Corps. Okay, so now we're playing as the uh, Marines for a bit now. Okay. Oh yeah, I remember. There's a couple of chapters where you play as the American Marines. Then it switches back to the SAS. Because the game is primarily from um, Soap's perspective, the first one. Marines. Spotters have a possible fix on all Assad in a building at the west end of this town. We're going to secure the perimeter and grab all Assad. Hurrah, lock and load. Okay, so that didn't have subtitles. Shoreline coming into view. Copy, Striker 6 4. Feet dry in 10 seconds. Copy. Oh, I remember this one. You're coming in hot and you're like, you're getting shot at and everything. This is pretty amazing, this, this opening moment. Like, where you're coming in on the uh, cop chopper. This is pretty interesting, actually. So I've got to follow him down. Let's go. Go, go, go. Squad on me to the target building. Go. The parking position. Let's go. Okay, yes. There's the target building. Left side door breach. Stack up. We only have claymores for this section. We're not as well equipped. That's a shame. Breach charge and blow the charge. Breaching, breaching. Go, go, go. Clear. God damn it! Wish they'd leave more for you to actually shoot. Take point. That. Oh, I'm playing Jackson. Okay, yeah, I remember. I remember this mission actually being really tough in the original. Like later on, this mission gets ridiculous. Like. Shotgun, yes, I'll take that. Shotgun, shotguns in COD are normally a really good idea. Jackson, throw a flashbang. Ah, that was actually a really bad idea. Yeah, the M9 is probably one of the crappiest weapons in the game. Let's be a bit more tactful this time, shall we? There we are. Flashbang in. Oops. Where'd that come from? Got him. Now that is what is great about like when Call of Duty works, it works. Oh, shut up! I thought he was dead. How did that work? I thought I killed that guy. Yeah, I could have swore I killed that guy. What the heck was up with that? <laughs> that was some serious BS. <laughs> okay. Right, the stairs. Take the stairs. All call signs. Check the bodies. We need a positive ID. 
copy on Al Assad. No sign of Al Assad here, sir. H2, this is Red Dog. Target building is secure, but we don't have Al Assad. Over. Roger that, HQ. Out. Heads up. I just got word that Al Assad is broadcasting half a click east of here to the TV station. We're gonna move out on foot and take down the package there. Move out. Reload. Guys, keep your head down. There's like flipping. Shoot. Grenade out. That will help, right? I think so, anyway. Let's take out a shotgun and. <laughs> that probably that airstrike probably just saved my ass. Not gonna lie. Down. Okay, there we are. Oh god, they're behind us. Okay, they yeah. Never use RPGs in this game. Man. It's just doesn't seem right because the game is based around infantry combat. Um, so it kind of makes no sense to have RPGs. Well, if you ask me, anyway. Yeah. I remember this game was uh, quite. Like, it had a lot of issues at the time because it was really looked down upon because of the whole stuff with the Afghanistan war and everything. But I don't think people took too kindly to the idea of um, art imitating life so closely. Did you catch my meaning? And this is also a multiplayer map. Literally, this is back in the days where games, their multiplayer maps were based off of stuff from the campaigns. Ow. Taking cover behind a goddamn Mini Cooper. This has got to be... You know it's bad when you're taking cover behind a Mini Cooper. Because that thing... Literally will would not stop a bullet. There's no way in hell that would stop a bullet. Oh wait, nuts. That's a nade. Get away from that. So now we're moving up through. Oh, damn, one of our guys just got nailed. That was pretty. pretty... Six, dumbass. Jesus. Why does no one ever check the six in this game? It is just like. Like, look at the NPCs. They're not even checking their six. This is crazy. Like, the NPCs. Are, I remember the NPCs in the old game being way smarter than this. They used to, like, flip in, check their sixes. They used to back up. There used to be a. L Yeah, I see him. Shoot! I'm trying to flush us out. Okay, I move up. And what is that? A cult? Uh, let's have a look. Is that a cult in the ground? No, that's an M9. Okay, that ain't no good. I was hoping it was a cult. Was, the cult is one of my favorite guns in like any video game, and like. 
this thing has the cult in it, so... Kind of hope we get to use it in the campaign. <laughs> Idiot. Like, just flip in, do some Punisher Warzone shit there. Flip in, poke my head around, and, uh, fire at him. Shoot. That is way too close for comfort. I actually really like this game. It, it just, just oozes atmosphere in a way modern Call of Duty's don't. Like... Well, we're breaching out, lads. Oh, we're breaching around the side, I remember. I remember this. Okay, let's go with the shotgun for close quarters. Um, kick the door. Oh, no, wait, we're using one of those fancy charges again, aren't we? Stack up, boys. God, that was some crappy accuracy on my behalf. Should have hit that. Um, oh, whoa. There's a weapon here. Oh, it's only an AK. There's literally AKs in abundance on this level, which is actually really fitting. Man, I love the campaign in... The modern, the original campaign in Modern Warfare was just flipping... I love this. The No Call of Duty captures... The campaign of Modern Warfare, uh, the original Modern Warfare, they just it just oozes something that the others don't have. Even its sequels don't have something like. I love Modern Warfare 2 and everything, bits of Ghost, but I just this game just oozes something that the others don't have, and I can't put my finger on it to save my life, and it's annoying me because I want to be able to tell you guys what it is. That makes me love this thing so much. Ah! Destroy his cover. Nice. Oh, wait. Hang on. Yeah, that, that was what... Oh, God. Move. <laughs> and this is honestly like... Say, just fighting in office buildings and stuff. It's And you're ducking... This game, you actually have to take cover. Whereas the other ones, you can just stand there soaking up damage. For, like, ages. Whereas this, I can just... I don't... I can't run around. I've literally got to be really really careful when I'm engaging in gunfights and like when I'm not I tend to die like I did earlier when I just didn't even check my corner like like that see I didn't check my six that's what happens um okay so and like just look details like this like the screen being shot up uh, man I'm so glad they did a remaster of this game because modern warfare the original Modern Warfare is the best Call of Duty. Like, if you ask me, it is the best COD. Like, it's the one that had it right. It's the one that set the groundwork for the later games. But also, after COD 4, I feel they kind of lost their way a bit. Which was kind of unfortunate. But, you know. I'm going to move up a bit. See if I can... Oh. Whoops. <laughs> Nobody saw that, am I? <laughs> Nobody saw that, okay? 12, 10, okay, so I'm guessing we're breaching in here somewhere? Well, we suppose. Oh, wait, there's still enemies in here. Then we just form up with the other guys. Yeah, I kind of accidentally blow one of my own squad members away with a shotgun. And the thing is, they don't just shrug it off either. But if I do that, they die. Oh, shut up, we oohrah crap. This is why I'd rather be with the SAS guys. No sign of al sir. All right. All in Marines. Stay frosty. The kicker is Al Assad. I don't. I don't think Al Assad is actually even here. So that's like the real kicker. RPGs, no.
and <laughs> just blow up the cars. That's probably the most effective thing to do in this uh, bit. Flipping, like, all the levels in COD 4 are way better than all the other ones as well. It's like... Anyway, guys... I'm not exactly sure how long... Just give me a moment while I check how long this episode's been running for, so... I'm gonna duck here, and I'm gonna... PC, how long have I been recording for? I've been recording for... 30 minutes, shit, okay, I'm probably going to cut this down, uh, hope you guys enjoy, and I'll see you in the next video, goodbye, and that's my